So I was in the Dollar Tree the other day and I realized just how funky some of the food choices are. So I decided to uh, taste test them for you guys. Now I gave myself a $10 price limit, meaning that there will uh, only be 10 items that I will be trying because hello, Dollar Tree. You're probably wondering where I am. I am in a car. I am driving. I'm working on getting back on the road. So applause to me. Ah, crowd goes wild. Good job. Congratulate me in the comments. <laughs> Our first uh, item is Poor Brothers Salt and Vinegar Chips. Old English kettle cooked potato chips. Mm. Wow, these are really good. You can ask anyone that knows me. They will tell you that my favorite kind of chip is salt and vinegar. Most of the items that I bought are things that I might actually try on a normal basis. Some of them aren't, but they're just like off brands that seem a little funky. Whether it's depending on the logo, as I did with this one, or just the name of them. And we have Animal Crackers, chocolate style. Oh, that opened really easily. What does this remind me of? I can imagine these taste like the off-brand chocolate part of an Oreo cookie, if that makes sense. Here are veggie jalapeno straws from Good Health. Enjoy being good. Smiley face. Um, I like veggie straws, um, like the actual brand of veggie straws, but these are supposed to be jalapeno, and I love spicy stuff. I mean, they look very similar to the original. 40% less fat than potato chips. Look at how cute they are looking out the window together. <laughs> I really like these actually. This is yummy. Next. These are things I've tried before. I think I tried them in the white cheddar version. I think I might have tried the kettle corn, but these are popcorners. They're pretty much popcorn made into the shape of chips. pocket knife it. Well, the way that this opened won't be easy to close. Here they are, they look a little funky. They're not better than popcorn, but they are surprisingly good. Freeze-dried strawberries. So natural. Oh, wow. They're whole strawberries. I was expecting them to be slices. You don't get much. I don't know. Gotta clear my taste palette. Now we're on to some good old fashioned plantain chips. I um, don't think I've ever tried this brand. I like salty plantain chips. I don't like them when they're sweet. So this is a 50-50 shot and really just not gonna like them. Well, I still got a lot of strawberry stuck in my teeth. Oh my. Mm -hmm. mm. They could use a little bit more salt, but they're still really good. I like them. Now these are the ones I am most excited for and most dreading trying. Chicken flavored crackers. I don't wanna know who thought of these. Honestly, everything I've tried so far, I've surprisingly liked a lot. I have a feeling that that's gonna all end with these chicken flavored crackers. It must be awkward for you guys to just watch me eat. It doesn't taste chicken flavored at all. I'm very confused. I would never buy these again, but I like them enough that I will finish them. They don't taste like chicken. With that said, I cannot tell you what they taste like. Now let's wash all this down with some blueberry lemonade. Please don't spill on me. Oh, got a little pop there. If you guys know me, I don't normally drink anything besides water. So this is an adventure for me. 
tastes like bad lemonade with something funky in it. I don't like it. Refreshing taste, remarkable value. I will say the value is good, but the taste is not refreshing at all. <laughs> I don't know what this is, what it tastes like. I mean, it's just pretty much food coloring. I digress. I think this is the first thing out of everything I bought that I will just not be finishing because I I just don't like it. We got this lemon flavored pie. I mean, pie is great, but buying it from a dollar store, I don't know, it's a little sketchy. Got this funky glaze on it. You can definitely tell it's old. It looks like an old crusty donut. Mm-mm, no. No, 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 no thank you. Go back in the bag. I don't like it. Oh, I don't like it. Now we get Pop Rocks. I didn't know that these were still sold in stores, but you get three packets. You have strawberry, tropical punch, and watermelon. Let's stay with the strawberry theme. This will be an adventure. Ah! You guys hear that? I'm just gonna put all the rest of them in there. Oh, the bag, yeah. Mm-mm, no. I have something to put in. I'm sorry, but no. They're fun for like two seconds, and then you're like, ah, oh, what's in my mouth? Get it out. Blah. Now is the time to rank least favorite to favorite. Least favorite would be this lemon pie. It was bad, didn't like it. Uh-uh, not gonna do it again. Next least favorite, Pop Rocks. I should have left them in my childhood as a fond memory. Next least favorite, or next favorite out of the least favorites would be the uh, blueberry lemonade. No thank you. Next favorite would be the chicken flavored crackers. Next favorite would be the dried strawberries. Next favorite are these kettle corn square triangle things. This is third favorite, are these animal crackers. I guess this would be third favorite, actually. Anyway. And then veggie straws are number two. And the winner is... Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba! These uh, salt and vinegar potato chips. Pill kettle chips. Yeah. Was this a waste of my money? I think that I will only be wasting $3 because of the, um, the Pop Rocks, the blueberry lemonade, and that lemon pie because I've just, I just don't want to eat those. I don't want to ingest them. You know, the chicken flavor crackers are like, bleh, you know. I'll eat them because I paid money for them and they're palatable. But these are not miniature chips, dude. They're good. And they look fancy too because they're kettle. Dumb. I have so much stuff in my teeth. So that's it for today. If you guys liked this kind of video where I taste test food or I eat and talk to you, let me know in the comment section below. I can do stuff more similarly to this. Yes. If you enjoyed um, watching me enjoy and dislike uh, wacky foods from the Dollar Tree and you liked this video, which I guess are the exact same thing, please give it a thumbs and if you want to become part of the Watered Down Tribe, just go down below, punch that red subscribe button, and jingle that bell so you'll be notified twice a week when I post. And I will see you on the flip side. I love you so much. Bye. Oh boy. Mm. You're on my steering wheel. Other little Awesome. Whoa!